like to add? We looked at a bunch of good people and what they did. We thought about like, people that helped in our community. Yeah. Look at all these great ideas, the librarian, the firefighter, all the ones that you just said. We can come up here and we can see each other's ideas and then we can try to choose maybe a top five. What are three words would you use to describe yourself? I would describe myself as probably lazy, I'm a gamer, and just sometimes energetic. I took pictures like up here and then I did some close-ups. It was like we were thinking about the community to interview someone in the community that interacted with it. We're going to be interviewing like you would be interviewing your person. Ms. Ellen's going to be the interviewee. Yeah. And then we're going to show them how we're going to switch. Yep. Your job while we are doing this is just to watch. How do you help others and why do you help others? We have talked about documentary filming and getting to know things and people that we'd usually just pass right by. I heard that you said that you're a carver. What do I like about it is I get to be creative and make a huge range of things from totem poles down to little tiny amulet carvings that you can hold in your hands. I am... Um, Believe it or not, shy. I am funny and I am very sensitive to people's feelings. Wind up a little bit. Okay, do you guys know about that program where you get fish in the lunches here? Mm -hmm. Do you like that? Yes. So I helped start that program because I care about kids and I think that we should be able to eat good food from right here in Sitka. Why do you help others? I kind of feel like I need to. Honestly, I came from a, a good family, but I kind of went the wrong way for a while. You do the things in Sika because you appreciate it and because everybody in Sika likes how the stuff you do. I like this one. Yeah, me too. Yeah. And that one. Four and then one more. Can we do this one? I think I should go like mine first and then Owen's because mine tells like kind of about the job and then Owen said his kind of tells about the history of the job. Julia loves to cook so she decided to work for a restaurant but people kept wait on wasting food. Interviewing is fun because when you ask the questions you don't really know what they're going to say. You don't want to make them feel uncomfortable. That's one thing, too. Don't. That's like the number one thing. Don't make them feel like they shouldn't be here right now. When writing down what they said, just put it in notes so you don't have to write the whole thing. But make sure it's understandable, too. You have to take the information and then decide how you want to put it and how you want to make it sound and to decide what you want people to think. Good angles. High quality. High quality. Nice content, all right? My favorite part was working all together because it wasn't just serious, 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 like you have to take at this angle only. This is the second time I've interviewed um, like a real adult. We got to get up and move around and go learn about other people's cultures and what they do for a living. Maybe it can inspire people to like do it so they can get to know people like their neighbor better. I think since they're all very nice people, it would represent Sika very well. I might want to try volunteering for some things, like Ms. Orbison. She volunteered for a lot of things.